I heard a saying yesterday that I want to share. I think it applies to Joe Biden as much as anyone I've ever seen. Once a man, twice a child. Once a man, twice a child. That's right. Once a man, twice a child. Think about that. Joe Biden has returned to a child state in many ways. He is visibly incompetent and certainly incontinent and in no way capable of leading this great nation of ours. But he's being led around by his nose, told what to say, what to sign, what to promote. And his handlers from the World Economic Forum and elsewhere must pull their hair out every time he deviates from the Megatron prompter because it puts all of the behind the scenes manipulation in danger of being exposed. But I digress. So where are we this morning? Well, with the puppet masters behind Joe Biden full-blown panic again, that's where we are. This time over where the hell did the last dump of classified documents show up from and how many more landmines are we about to hit? The fact is, they don't know. Neither do we. Right now I'm taking the over on the bet that there are more than two piles of classified documents in Joe Biden's possession right now that those pursuing former President Donald Trump would call illegal. Yeah, I'm taking the over because now that they are tumbling out of the darkness, I believe it will continue. Because there are a few honest journalists left out there in the world that will actually pursue this story. And yes, it is a big story. The takeaway is this. It's all or none. It is all or none for Joe Biden and former President Donald Trump. Either having these classified documents from former administrations constitute a serious violation of the law, or they do not. You can't have it both ways. You can't pursue Trump on one hand and dismiss Biden on the other. 